Last week, Farmers Weekly joined the Prince's Countryside Fund at their emergency fundraising hay pigeon shoot. The charity is currently offering valuable support to British farmers struggling after a year where the climate has wreaked havoc on crops and livestock alike. Waitrose boss and chairman of the fund, Mark Price, spoke to us about the day. We're here on this absolutely glorious day to raise money for the Prince's Countryside Fund through having a charity clay pigeon shoot. 84 people in a, a whole range of teams are taking part and I'm delighted to say that we've raised £50,000 for the charity. The Prince's Countryside Fund looks to do three things. First of all, what we want to do is sustain the vitality of our countryside and the enterprise there. Secondly, we want to reconnect people with the countryside and what it does. And thirdly, we raise money for the emergency funds. This last year has been a really difficult year for British farmers and I'm delighted to say that so far this year the fund has donated half a million pounds to the different farming charities. We're looking for the money today to go into that pot so we can give even more money in the year ahead. The emergency fund was launched into action earlier this year. We caught up with the director of the Prince's Countryside Fund, Victoria Harris, to find out exactly where the money goes. So we've raised £50,000 today, which is a fantastic addition to the 600000 that we've given away since the beginning of the year. And that's going to go to those farming help charities that are helping to ship fodder from parts of the country that have it to others that don't, to provide emotional support for isolated farmers that are really struggling and whose businesses are about to go under, down to the simplest things like food vouchers for farmers, which can seem quite ironic, <laughs> but um, even support with the domestic bills and helping with a bit of cash flow in the farm business as well. Um, so a whole range of different practical support measures. Celebrity chef Heston Blumenthal and ambassador for the fund joined the ranks of wannabe hotshots. He told us afterwards while he was lending his support to the fund. Um, British farming has had a pretty, bit of a tough time. It's actually had a really difficult year. Not just the fact that the weather has been atrocious, summer bad, winter bad, but there's been a few fairly major kind of scandals that have, that have affected um, confidence in the produce. Take the fat duck, all our fish comes from British waters. 95% of our meat is British. Um, and even if I see a, I was shown an incredible um, aged piece of beef from Switzerland, it was fabulous. I'm not gonna put it on the menu because it's not British. We need to recognize that great ingredients doesn't grow on trees, if you can see, <laughs> pardon, the, uh, par pardon the metaphor, but it, it, it's so important. We, we, we need to feel proud of, what, of, of the ingredients we have in this country. And that is only going to happen if we give the farmers as much support as possible. So my, my role in this is to try and help this uh, charity grow as much as possible, to give as much support for British farmers, because we really need it. That's the way you're shooting. Well, good man, get into it. If you'd like to support the fund, text PCF to 70300 for a £3 donation or donate online at princescountrysidefund.org.uk.